pandemic first uh, started, if you like, in March, didn't it, 2020, which was just coming into springtime. <clears throat> so basically, we had to just shut. We shut the farm gates so there was no people could come up on on uh, unannounced, and then we had. Um, we just carried on basically in the spring as normal. We had our own tractors with our own disinfectant in. We we would go round through to to do the spring work, basically as we would before, but without meeting anybody. There were various um, government COVID grants available that we could apply for. Where we we did apply for one or two to help. Um, businesses that were hit by the uh, pandemic which helped us through quite a lot uh, socially obviously social life came to a stop all the agricultural shows were cancelled in the last 12 months the changes have been oh, unbelievable really in the farming because of well started with the war in ukraine which pushed up the price of gas through the roof with fertilizers made from gas it pushed up the price of diesel oil and then of course everything's delivered on trucks or vans to the farm so that pushed haulage up through the roof um fertilizer quadrupled in price didn't it quadrupled in price fertilizer yeah, yeah. and they they couldn't get there. and they closed the big factory that's just by us in chester here in Ince. they closed oh. the fertilizer factory there because they couldn't afford to make the gap with because the gas price and it's still closed never so now opened. we're importing it all aren't we now It'll we've got open. egyptian this time egyptian what else we have? Lithuanian. lithuanian russian mm. no they don't but yeah, they no that was russian. before the war sorry yeah 